Hello everybody, welcome back to WWT. You look at my skip show, Mike C. That's uh, very well. Hey, today we're reviewing Uncharted. Again, now nah, it's called Uncharted Lost Legacy. Now this only came out on PlayStation 4. Exclusive. But, oh yeah. <laughs> it stole it from Microsoft. <laughs> <laughs> hey, but before we start talking about it, as always, we like to give it a number of facts. Mike, how many facts do you give Uncharted Lost Legacy? Lost Legacy? Actually, I give it a 4 out of 5, man. How about yourself? Uh, Mike, I'm going to give it a 4 out of 5, too, man. Why did you give it a 4 out of 5? Mike? Okay, I give it a 4 out of 5 because it just felt like it was like an addition to it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I think this could have been DLC, honestly. Right. Really. Um, I don't know for really how long it is, but but it, it does give you a feel of an open world, but it's more linear. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? There's certain parts of the map you can know. You can go and do some uh, treasures and everything like that, or you can skip to the end and miss out on stuff. But if anybody played Uncharted, you would want to get all the treasures and everything and search and everything, which means hours and hours of searching and everything, which is good for Uncharted fans. As far as the combat and everything, I enjoyed all that. It was pretty fluid. I like the banter between the characters because uh, Naughty Dog is known for, known for their... Uh, their their uh their voice their voiceover work mm -hmm. and as far as making the people grounded and making them feel alive so that was true to these characters too the villain uh he was kind of weak weak type of villain but but still that uh banter between you know uh you know the two main uh, characters was was real good so I really did enjoy it and the graphics still were top notch granted it wasn't I think there was so sp uh points where it wasn't as fluid as the actual Uncharted mm -hmm. game the first one was itself. Because it took a lot of time to really polish and everything, but all in all, it's a great game. You suffering? Uh, now, me on the graphics, I think that they look good. I don't think they look great. I right. think they could have been a little bit more. Mm -hmm. I think that this uh, could have been a story within itself and not piggyback off of the series. Uh -huh. Now, it may scare you that the it's not a full price game. It's only like 40 bucks. Yeah. And that tends to scare me. How long is this game right. and is it worth the 40 bucks? Now, I do think it's worth the 40 bucks. I think any game that you get this that you can pay $40 for is good. Um, the multiplayer. Um, now, I haven't got the chance to play the multiplayer, right. but yeah. I thought that if you played the multiplayer with another person, they were pro supposed to be able to control the other person Ooh. that's what I thought I may be wrong uh, put in the comments if you are able to do that right. or not I didn't play the multiplayer myself either so and um, overall I, I, I think it was a good game right. I think graphically it could have been a lot better and um, you know for what it's worth it, it was pretty good man um, the storyline was great I, I love the way like you said Naughty Dog uh, do the the voiceovers, and um, it, it's a good game, man. It's a pretty decent game. Yeah, yeah. Um, I think during this time of period where, you know, this is running up to the, the game by season, this is a nice little one that's going to hold you or tide you over mm -hmm. until the further releases in the fall. So, yeah, it's a pretty, uh, i say it's a pretty solid game. So, that's our, that's our take on it. So, why don't we give it a final verdict? Final verdict. Charge, Lost Legacy. I give... Oh, yeah, I gave him the rating. <laughs> so I say, go ahead and buy it, man. Go ahead and buy it, man. It's only 40 bucks, and I think you get your money's worth of it. So, buy it. So, definitely get this game. Definitely. It is a pretty good game for the price. Mm -hmm. You're not going to be disappointed. I just right now don't know how long this $40 game is. Right. But it's well worth it. Yeah. You know, you can't Because I've been playing it and everything, and nowhere close to the end. So, man, go ahead and get this thing, man. Yeah. Go ahead and get this Indeed. thing. Indeed. All right, so like always, you guys can hit us up at the Game Show gmail.com. That's the Game Show with today. Don't forget to head over to the Facebook store page where you find lower price products. Don't forget to hit us up on VTime. Don't forget to subscribe to the Games Club member. And don't forget about the $1 Mario raffle and the Mega Mushroom raffle. So you get some free stuff. Well, not free stuff. You got to pay for it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you can enter these contests and get stuff. And I think we're doing something about some football, too. What are we doing, yeah. for it? And the Madden tournament as well, where we're giving away a copy of Madden on the Xbox and on the PlayStation. All right, all right. And please remember to like, subscribe, and follow all our social media networks. Join our Steam Labs community and our website community where you can get some free stuff. All right. And we'll see you next time on WWTF. The Game Show. See you next time you're watching. Let's do this.